Hey guys, it's your girl Moyen and welcome back to my channel and today I'll be doing a hair review for you guys and it's from, um, it's one of those Amazon wigs and yeah, I actually saw it's my baby ordered this from Amazon I was like, you know what, I'm gonna order it, I'm gonna take a look, I'm gonna see if it's nice and if I like it, if it can wear and you know, if it's all of them good stuff that YouTubers always be saying that, oh this hair is bomb and then when you get the hair, it's like trash so I'm gonna just review this for you guys to let y'all know if it's good or if it's not. So the, the hair that I got, I'm gonna have it right here. I think it was around forty dollars, and the, like tax was about three dollars for shipping tax for tax or whatever kind of tax. I don't know, but the tax was around three dollars. So I paid like forty three dollars for this in all U.S. price. And then when it came to Jamaica, I paid like a thousand and something Jamaican dollars to. So um, clear it and yeah, so let's get on into this video So this is the here. This is the package that it comes in. This is how it looks So it's black bag with like clear. Um, I think this is supposed to represent here Yeah, it's here. So that's an afro looking here like and then it's like that And it has the brand that I guess it's the place that works. And it has the inner lictor. Is that how it's pronounced? I don't know. Here, my beauty. And all that lovely does. So this one is the um, pink lace front wig. And it says it comes with a wig cap and all of that. So, let's see. Alright, so I guess when you take it out the bag, it's in another bag. Just one of those clear seat bag. And you also get this. With it, which is the um, wig cap, I'm gonna put this on. I actually tried braiding my hair. I cannot braid. I cannot braid. If you have seen like some of my other videos, you'd know that I can't braid. But I attempt, and this is what we have so far. My sister wasn't here, so she can carry it back. But we're gonna work with this, okay? So I'm gonna put this on. So it's just like a regular black wig cap. I don't think when I'm installing the hair, I'm actually going to use this. But let's put it on for now and see what happens. Oh, and it has like hair out. So if you have like ponytail or something, I don't know. Oh, this is... Ow. Alright, so this is... A little bit tight but I guess it's supposed to be I don't know Alright, so that's that. I'm gonna take that over here. And send a little wig thingy. Take that off. And then it has like that. And then there you have or here. And it's actually really synthetic here because it does feel like synthetic here. Um rubbing my fingers straight. And it does shed a lot like a lot yeah this here actually does shed pretty much like a whole lot but I'm gonna just brush this out and see I'm use my big tea comb just comb that through so we can just apply this all right so this is how inside the wig cap look is And it comes with the adjustable straps right here, a comb right here at the front and at the other side. So the comb is at the sides and then you have the, um, the adjustable straps at the back. Then the lace is, I'm not sure how much this is but the lace comes from ear to ear, ear to ear and you have like 
just the regular basic middle part so yeah let's put on this wig and see what happens guys I don't really know how to put on a wig this is actually my first wig like first wig ever but we're gonna work with it we're gonna we're gonna see what we can do yeah All right, right here is looking buffy. You guys know it's because of the cornrow that's right there. It does. I'm gonna use, let's see. All right, I'm gonna attempt to use the comb right here, but if I'm installing this, I won't be using the comb because my edges are very, very sensitive and they're easily fun. They're easy to be pulled out. So I don't really like anything touching my edges. So. But this looks good. Alright, so now that we have the combs in place and we have the um the lasket in place, yo, this here is actually pretty cute. But the shedding is not doing it any justice. It does tangle because I just took it out of the pack and already it's tangled. So So I ain't gonna lie, this here, this is some that's in the comb, and then we have all this that is on me. So the hair sheds like crazy, but you know, this ain't a hair that I would have in like every day. I'm not gonna be rocking pink hair every day, so I don't think it will be a bother for me because, like I said, it ain't something that I'll be wearing every day. But it does have some uh, it does have some really beautiful curls and it is like pretty long so it almost catches me like at the butt so yeah so it does it's actually a really pretty color here like it's not too pink but also it's not too like rose like goldish so, and you get let me see yo my sister have comb what's it called rat tail or whatever you call it rat tail combs or whatever but the tail is always broken anyways I'm gonna show you how much lace you get so if you're doing a part this is probably as far as you can part and you're probably going to want to pluck some of those like a little bit so it looks a little bit more natural whenever you're wearing it all right so that's it for this wig this is how it is you know when you have smaller cornrows like going straight back then right here won't be so puffy like it looks in the camera and I actually think this wig looks really nice on my skin tone. Like, does it? Does it not? What do y'all think? Okay. 
but like I said I'm not gonna um, install this now so I'm just gonna tell you guys how it is directly out from the box like you can see the part is here but it's not like flat so if you do want it flat you can apply heat to this here but I wouldn't like put it all the way up probably like 200 and something um, and then just use it to just press out these parts when you find whatever parts you want then you just press it out so that you can have here looking nice and flat and this this lace it actually blends in with my skin really well so you know you see some people and they'll be like bleaching their laces and stuff like that this you don't have to do any of that it does like really blend in well so yeah and like I said before, it is ear to ear. So pull this down right here. Here. You'll be able to catch your hair up like this if you want to. And those won't be showing. Just make sure you have really good hair glue. Um, if you're in like America or Canada, one of those cool countries, then got to be glue will work for you to keep your lace front down. But the thing is, what I've noticed, if you're in a Caribbean country where it really does get hot, got to be glue might not help for you because I realized anytime my sister uses it, like we'll keep her hair down, but in a couple minutes or so it will be lifting. It doesn't matter which one, it just won't work. Like it's more, it's a gel, so it does work for persons in cold countries. However, for persons in warmer temperature countries like in the Caribbean and so forth, it. It's not gonna work. It's just not. So yeah. This is so cute. And then you know you can once you can cut your lace up here. Then you can take a little bit of hair and use these to be like baby hairs. You don't need a lot. Just use your comb and just cut it downwards. And you know, sleek your baby hair. But yeah, that's it for this wig. It is bomb, it is pretty, it is beautiful. It sheds like crazy. But if you're looking for a quick wig for a quick event or whatever, then this here can work. But you just have to know that it does, it is synthetic here, it is a cheap wig, so it sheds a lot. But if you have the um, all right, what's it called? The got to be glue spiking freezing spray or you have your spritz then you can apply that to your brush and then you just brush it down and keep everything in place and all of that but yeah I actually love this color wig when I do apply the wig I probably will record myself applying my wig or if somebody else apply it for me then I'll record them doing that and you guys will get to see. and you guys will get to see how I look with this wig on so that's it for this video. It is a bomb ass wig. It is cute. It is full. It is long, but shit sheds like crazy boo. <laughs> it does shed. It does shed. It sheds a lot, but it is cheap. It is a cheap, affordable wig and it is from, well, it doesn't matter where it's from. It's a cheap wig, It's but it's affordable. So if you want something for like a quick event or you're gonna just use it like probably once now and then, then you can definitely order this wig if you like. I don't, well, I have the link for it below. I don't know. Yeah, I will. And yeah. So once you pluck, apply your baby edges and stuff, then sis, you go, your hair go be bomb, you go be looking cute, your summer about to be fly, your bathing suit pictures about to be fly, your IG pictures about to be fly, boo. So yeah. 
But that's it for this video. If you like, then give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, it's okay. Go ahead and give it a thumbs down. And I'll see you guys in... <laughs> There's so much hair in my face. That's it for this video, guys. If you like, then go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, it's okay. Give it a thumbs down. If you're a returning member, then welcome back to my channel, goodie. <laughs> And if you're new here, go ahead and subscribe so you don't miss another video. Like, hit a subscribe button, boo. What are you waiting for? Anyways, guys, that's it for this video. And yeah, remember, your afro is your crown. Be creative, be bold, be beautiful, be you. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye!